So this is just a quick video on um, what I do to keep Edgar looking good every day. So um, it's going to be um, doing his face, cleaning his eyes um, and also giving him a brush as well. So this is just what we do every day. Now um, I'm going to start with cleaning his eyes. I use one of these little reusable cloths. I used to use little cotton pads, um, but just because this is reusable, so there's less waste, just use one of these every day so I can clean them. So to start off, we're going to use this stuff um, called IMV, and so this is just a liquid, basically to remove the the brown staining that he can get around his eyes. So I just put a really small amount on the cloth just to make it damp. Um, you know, don't want to soak soak his face in it basically. And then what we're gonna do is basically just rub the hair around his eyes. Um, so you can just rub outwards in the same direction of the hair and then you can rub against as well, just to get right down to the skin. You get all of that staining off and then on the other side as well. And obviously this is something that I've done with Edgar since he was a kitten. So he's really good and he lets me do it. It's really important to get cats like these um, that are going to need a lot of grooming used to it from a young age. Um, otherwise you, it's going to be a lot more difficult when they're older to be doing this every day. There we go. So that's the first step. Um, and what I like to do is just to um, give that a bit of time just to dry. Um, so while we're waiting for that, we will give him a brush. So I have a, a comb and, um, and just like a normal paddle brush that I like to use. So what I tend to start doing is just um, using the comb to get any mats out of the hair. And I just follow the line of... Um, the hair growth. So I'm just going to do this nice and quickly just to show you. So on his chest as well. Right down the body. Good boy. I know. Let's go over here. His tail. Down the backs of his legs and those little pantaloons. Ooh, got some grass on you there. <laughs> Good boy. Don't know if you guys can hear that on the camera, but Edgar is purring now, so he obviously enjoys getting brushed. Yeah. You do, don't you? Don't show your butt to the camera. Don't do that. And then obviously you mustn't forget your belly. Oh. A little mat there. So, once you've got all the mats out with a comb, cat trying to escape, um, then what you want to do is actually get your brush um, and you brush towards the head, so against the, the um, way the fur grows. So it's basically like back combing, and what this does is make sure you've gone right down to the, the skin, so you're getting all that um, dead coat up. It also makes them look super fluffy, which is always good as well. So he looks super handsome by the end. Which is what we want. Mm. Obviously if you've got like a grooming table or something like that, sometimes that can make it a bit easier. Um, but most of you are probably just going to be 
sat on a seat, sat on a bed. We usually sat on the bed. Brushing Edgar before bed. So we go right up the backs of those legs, around his tail. And you're just basically aiming towards that head. Mm. Yeah. In your chest as well. Super football. So obviously I've done this dead quick for the video. That's the general result we get. Super big floof ball. And you get covered in hair yourself. So it's always good to put something on your knee. Fabulous. So now we've given him a lovely brush and he's looking all fluffy. And we're going to go back to those eyes. So hopefully we have dried off just a little bit. So uh, we're going to be using another IMV. Um, product. This is the powder this time. Um, so what that does is obviously uh, it dries, dries the fur in the skin, and it does um, reduce risk of any um, sort of infections in the skin um, if the skin stays uh, moist all the time. So what we're going to do? I've just got a normal uh, like makeup brush. You can get I Envy do do their own special brush, and you basically just apply the powder um, all around the eyes. And if your cat um, particularly gets staining on their chin as well, then you can use this product on their on their chin as well. You basically, pop it all on there. And then put them on your chin. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. And what I tend to do is just get my finger then and just rub it into the little crevices of his face. So that's generally what I would do on a daily basis. Um, sometimes if I think he needs a little bit extra, like that, that staining is just being a little bit stubborn, um, then I've also got this product called BioGroom, which is basically a little bit like face paint for his face, um, but this works really well to um, combat any, any brown staining. So what I tend to do is just like a white face paint, just pop a bit on my finger, and again we're just adding it over that eye area like that with my finger now on the other side as well like so Boy, and then it comes with this little brush which is basically like a little eyebrow brush yes it is um, and then so basically you can just brush it in like that, so you're just sort of making sure you get good coverage. So you're brushing it out like that. So it coats every hair, and then you can use like the soft one just to rub it in as well. Here we go. Perfect. Well, there you have it. One very handsome, fluffy cat. And obviously, I always end a grooming session on a treat, so we'll go get you a little dreamy now for being such a good boy. Um, that's it. So wave goodbye. Goodbye. Bye.